For Comedy Hive News, I'm John Abba. It looks like the reactions from Netflix's Good Times animated series can to roll in. After voices involved in a new series, Sling Johnson and Yvette Nicole Brown defended the series. Stars of the original 1970s live action version have now decided to chime in. Now, The Hollywood Reporter would recently catch up with John Amos, who portrayed James Evan for the first three seasons. He would go on to say that the new show will have a hard time living up to the original. If you remember, Amos was famously fired from the show after protesting stereotypical content with Norman Lear and other staff writers. Both Amos and Esther Rowe, who played the matriarch Florida Evans, would constantly go back and forth with the writers and producers over what they considered buffoonish behavior. When The Hollywood Reporter asked Amos for his thoughts on the new series, he said, I really can't form an opinion as I've not seen any of the episodes yet. Norman and the entire cast and company set the bar pretty high. They'll have a hard time reaching that level of entertainment and education. I wish them the best. I see people aspiring to do that, but I don't see anybody reaching that goal, especially in an animated version. Now, The Hollywood Reporter not only interviewed Amos for his thoughts on the Good Times reboot, they also got the opportunity to speak with Bernadette Stannis, who played Amos's daughter, Thelma Evans. During her interview, Stannis would mention that she hasn't seen the trailer for the animated version yet, but was aware of the mixed reviews involving it. In the end, Stannis stated she understood the confusion from some fans, as they may think that the original cast was associated with this new update. Probably a lot of people don't know how Hollywood works. A lot of times you use a certain name to open the door for a new show. That could be what it is. But I'm sure a lot of people will be a little confused at first because they have to think that it's us. They think, oh my God, that's got to be Thelma, JJ, and Michael. And then you come in in there and you don't see anything like that. In addition, Stannis would also reveal that Netflix had reached out to her in order to provide a voice in the new show. She stated that both her and Jimmy Walker, known for playing JJ in the original live action series, will make appearances as minor characters. I did a little voice for them, but I did not know it was going to be the way it is. I thought it was going to be different. It's just a little here and there, but I think they did that because they knew what their show was going to be like. So I guess they figured if you put us in there, it wouldn't look so bad or whatever. It appears as both stars are currently reserving their full judgment on the series until it's released. However, from their comments, they clearly still hold the original series in a high regard. So what do you guys think about John Amos and Bernadette Stannis? Comments on the animated Good Times? Let's talk about it more in the comments below. Plus, stay up to date for the latest news and comedy by subscribing here to our YouTube channel and follow Comedy Hype across all social media. For Comedy Hype News, I'm John Abba.